Hi guys and welcome to Vlogmas Day 5. I'm Yolanda and here I like to share different practices and tips I use in order to improve both my mental and physical health. So I'm not just surviving, but thriving. As part of Vlogmas, I am continuing to share my wellness journey, um, which I started back in January 2nd, if you're not familiar. I weighed in at 351 pounds. I initially started doing low carb, plateau pretty quickly. Um, did some research and found out about rolling fasting, which I have pretty much been doing ever since. I typically do rolling 72s where you don't eat for 72 hours. I personally have a window of two hours to eat and then you start it all over again. Um, as of last week, I weigh in, in weekly on Wednesday. So come back Wednesday and I'll have an update for you guys. As of last Wednesday, I always get it wrong. I think I weighed 284.6. I'll put it up. Um, so I've lost over 66 pounds. And now you're all caught up. But feel free to check out any of my videos. Hopefully they're popping up all around this video. Click through to learn more about my journey. So today's vlog, this topic was inspired by my mother. Back in March, I went to visit her for her birthday and I walked into her room and there was this contraption like sitting in her room that had like a platform and like a railing around it. It was, it wasn't that big. You can tell you were supposed to step on it. So I asked her, well, what is this? And she told me that it was a vibration plate. Immediately, I thought back to, I think it was probably the 80s. I mean, I was born in the 80s. So I think it was the 80s when they used to have this like belt you would strap in on a machine and it'd be like right your waist. Y'all remember that? I was like, oh Lord, mama, you in these contraptions. And she uses it, you know, it's like a, a workout for her. Um, but anyway, so I still had to step on it. I had to try it for myself to see why would you have this big old thing <laughs> sitting in your room? And as soon as I got on it, it released tension in my lower back. And this was at the end of a day, a long day of travel. And it was just what the doctor ordered. Like, I didn't even know I needed this until I got on it. When I tell you, I felt so much better after just being on it 10 minutes. And I knew I had to have it. <laughs> So probably while I was still on my trip to see my mother, I started researching uh, vibration plates and I wanted to find one for myself that was a little bit more like low profile so they can fit into like a room, a corner, a closet out of the way easily. And I found one that I liked. And so by the time I got home and was talking to the hubby, I already knew exactly which one I wanted. <laughs> which was a turbo vibration plate by Life Pro. I'll link the one that I have down below. Of course, I had to make sure that it weighs, its weight capacity could hold me um, and anyone else who may want to use it in my home. That was very important to me as well as um, like a lifetime warranty type thing. But anywho, while I was doing my research, I came across all these other benefits the back was enough for me to say, uh, sign me up. But the additional benefits that it came along with it, I was like, okay, so here goes. It helps to decrease stress. It relieves your joint and your back pain. It boosts metabolism. It also gains mobility and flexibility. It increases your core strength. It improves your circulation. And it helps to develop stronger bones. So with all those benefit claims, especially the reduction in back and joint pain, I had to make it part of my daily routine. I use my vibration plate one to three times a day. I know three times can be a little excessive, but let me break it down for you. The morning is when I use it most often. It's a good like wake you up and gets you warmed up 
for exercise if you exercise first thing in the morning. So I'll get up, get prepared to go to the gym. In my gym clothes, the last thing I do before I leave the house, aside from getting water, <laughs> is hop on my vibration plate. I like to call it my shaky board or shaky shaky. So uh, I might say that instead of vibration plate because let's keep it real. So when I, in the morning when I get on my shaky shaky or my shaky board, <laughs> I um, use the first few minutes. I'm usually on it for about 10 minutes in the morning. I got, I got 10 minutes before I have to get out of here. But I usually take the first few moments to pray and to meditate and just kind of ease myself into the day. And then I start doing more light stretching, um, you know, some neck rolls, some shoulder rolls. And, oh, let me tell you guys, on the particular board I have, the Turbo Plate by Life Pro, it has eight different pre-programmed settings. So when I get on, I just go to the setting that I would use for that time of day. So like the first four are light right a more gentle shake so i do use um anywhere between p2 and p4 in the morning to like p meaning program two or program four um to like more gently shake myself awake <laughs> and get things flowing so typically okay i get on i set that i do my prayer my meditation i start light stretching it may be some just head rolls, gentle head rolls, shoulder rolls, and then I may, you know, stretch my back. Um, I'm probably showing you in a clip right now some of the moves I do on the board, particularly in the morning. By the end of the 10 minutes, you physically feel warmer. So the claims of circulation improving, I truly believe, like I can feel all the juices and all the blood just pumping and warming my entire body. The second time I will use the shake board is after a workout. It is great for muscle recovery. Now for that session, I will stay on between 10 and 20 minutes. And I do a more deeper and I hold my stretches a little bit longer. And I increase the program that I'm using to either somewhere between program six and program eight, which is the max. Cause I'm really trying to shake the muscles out and get them back loose. Third time would be in the evening, basically right before bedtime, I will use it between 20 and 30 minutes. I know it's a long time, but it's good for the purpose in which I use it, which is to decompress from if it was a stressful day or if it was a, a highly physical day, or if I'm just revved up, it will tire me out. I take a bath and I am knocked out if I stay on this um, shaky board for 30 minutes. Crazy. Now, that's the different ways that I use it. Um, but you can also use it as a low impact workout platform. Like I've seen videos where people, you know, do push-ups on it or um, all sorts of movement. Hold on just one second. It even comes with like these resistant bands for like strength training. So you can tighten the resistance and make it tougher. I personally don't use this aspect of the turbo vibration plate. Um, I do leave it on there just in case someone else in my family wants to use it. But I prefer to lift um, weights in the gym um, right before I do my cardio. So I don't use that feature of it. But it's there if you would like to use it. Okay, let's go back to the benefits list. I want to see if I have had improvements in these particular areas. So the first one was decrease of stress. I do use it as a stress reliever specifically at the end of the day and it's effective for me the second one was relief of joint and back pain now we all know the first time i stepped on it i immediately felt a relief in my back pain like a reduction and that has been a consistent 
thing um, to where when I feel back pain, I get on, it helps. Now, joint pain, I don't know that I feel that immediately. And the fact that I have been on this wellness journey um, also helps, right? Because, you know, if you lose 66 pounds off of your joints, your joints tend to feel better. So um, I can't contribute that all to the shaky board. <laughs> and the same goes for our boost in metabolism. The different lifestyle changes I made are certainly helping we, me with an increased metabolism and um, a reduction in fat. So did the shaky board help? Indirectly, I believe. Indirectly. Gaining mobility and flexibility. Again, I think it may be indirectly, but I do do probably, do do, <laughs> probably about 80% of my stretching happens on that board. So, it may have made me stretch more, which then made me more flexible. Okay, a check. It's a check for Life Pro. Increased core strength. I don't know. I guess it's kind of like being on one of those balancing balls. It's like you have to stabilize your core in order for it to, in order to stay balanced. So the shaking of the board innately makes you tighten up so I can see where it would strengthen your core improve circulation yes because I can feel it specifically first thing in the morning I can feel it waking up my circulation system and getting everything nice and warmed and primed and ready for the day the last one is to develop stronger bones I sure hope it's helping my bones but I don't know the turbo vibration plate has truly become an integral part of my wellness journey. Um, the fact that it helps me decompress mentally and relieves pain and wakens up my body physically makes me so happy that I stepped on my mother's and wanted to copy her. <laughs> Thanks, mom. <laughs> If you gotten this far in the video, thank you so much for watching and for your continued support. It really means a lot. And go ahead, leave me a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button if you haven't yet, because it really helps out the channel and me. But most importantly, I want you guys to have an amazing day. Bye guys.